What's up everyone? It's your boy Skid. And I don't like making update videos. I don't like update videos in general. I miss back when YouTube was just a big stomping ground of people making videos for the fun of it. You didn't have to know the person's name, where they're from, what they look like, the circumference of their anus. It was just someone making videos and you could binge watch that shit all day. And that's why I've tried to make this channel for a really long time. I've just tried to make it me. Playing video games, the same thing pretty much over and over. So if someone enjoys what I do, they can just keep watching it, binge it, and forget about life for a little while. But I haven't really been making videos in a pretty good while, at least not regularly. And I felt like it was... I feel like it's time to let you guys in a little bit on what's going on with my life and where I've been for the past little while. So around this time last year, I was making videos pretty regularly. I just recently made Fat Taurus and was riding the wave of popularity I had gotten from that. I was getting to do some incredible things I never thought I would get to in a million years. I was rubbing elbows with content creators who I had been watching for years and I thought I'd never even have a chance to talk to in person. I was having a real hoot and a holler making videos. I was having a real good time. You know, I was, you know, busting fat nuts and big old butts. I was having a real good time is what I'm trying to say and... I can't even I can't even begin to express how grateful I am to all those video makers and streamers who let me be a part of their channels and to all of you guys, you know, cuz without all of you I would have never gotten to do those things. So thank you from this sad Eeyore sound alike for letting me get to do those things for all these years. And yeah, like I said, there for a while I was having a real ball making videos just having a really good time entertaining people here on the internet, and for a while it seemed like everything was going to be really hunky-dory. And then towards the autumn, maybe a little bit more towards into the winter of last year, I had two very close friends of mine pass away, almost within weeks of each other, and I didn't take it very well, and it still hurts, and it will for a long time, but when it very first happened, I didn't take it well. I neglected myself, I neglected the people around me, and I made a lot of mistakes and made a lot of choices that I wish I could go back and change, but I can't. And the only, needless to say, I didn't really feel like making videos, and the only time that I did was when I needed just some kind of escape from my mental state and how I felt at the time. But thanks to my family and all the incredible friends I have here online and in real life, I pulled through it, and all the support that the people from like my Discord server, people over on Twitter that I know, just all the, all the really heartwarming, incredible things that people said were really a shoulder for me to lean on, and I, I have a hard time express, expressing um, expressing emotion a lot of times, but from the bottom of my heart, I would really like to thank those people and. Thanks to them, I've been getting a lot better, and I'm almost back to my old self now. I feel much better than I did before, and I've sort of hopped back on the bike with getting back into my old routine and getting back to how I was before everything happened. And so that brings me to where my shitting ass has been more recently. As some of you may remember, about a month ago I started uploading videos again and then stopped all of a sudden. It's not that I'm feeling all doo-doo stinkums and sad again or anything like that. I've been planning a trip to go see my girlfriend in Montreal, and that's actually where I'm going this Sunday. I'm flying out to see her, and my ass has never been outside the country. I've never flown on a plane, and it's not exactly a brisk walk over to Reddington or anything like that. It's actually quite a ways away for me, so all of my spare thought and spare time have been put into that trip making sure I'd, making sure that I don't turn into a screaming hairy baby man child on the middle of the flight or anything like that and yes that's where I've been that's where I am now and as far as where I'm going I honestly can't wait to start making videos for you guys again I had so much fun making videos back in the day on the huge and I can't wait to get back into it and sometimes when things weren't looking so great, some of the nice emails and messages you guys would send me really helped. Seeing that my videos help people through their shit and help them feel better when things aren't looking so great really made me feel a lot better about myself and what I was doing. So, thank you. From the bottom of my heart, again, thank all of you for your nice words. And... I recently opened up my Twitter messages to see what the unread section had and thank all of you for the massive amount of penis pictures I've I've got on there. Thank you. I 
really appreciated looking at that the other day. So yeah, I just felt like opening up a little bit. And um, I guess if there are any people out there that are feeling down, I know there are a lot of younger people that are going through a lot of weird things with their lives right now. A lot of teens watch my channel. And to anyone out there that's going through anything kind of bad, just, it gets better. It really does. It might take some time and things might look down and, you know, gritty, but you just gotta keep on grinding for that ass and titty. Eventually things will get better. So, yeah, that's it for this video. See ya.